gonna be a honky tonk Christmas. These silent nights at home are killing me. It's gonna be a honky tonk Christmas. Christmas, my kind of Christmas right there, a little Alan Jackson for you tonight. I did a cover on this as well, and I'll put a link to that cover down below in the description there. Uh, you can follow along with it, play along with it if you like. Uh, this is the, uh, I think this is the key he does it, and I listened to a couple of versions, and it seemed like one of them was capoed up one, still playing an A, and one wasn't, I don't know. Anyway, I'm playing this one open. So, uh, anyway, my name's Keith Williams, by the way, uh, with Fretmore Guitar Lessons, where we fret more stress less and make a whole lot of music and forget what we're doing most of the time. But anyway, uh, I'm going to try to remember a few things tonight. And uh, anyway, like I say, this is pretty, a pretty simple song, and i uh, show you kind of what we're doing. I, I do a little picking in the cover. I'm not sure if I'm going to do all that in the... In, in this lesson because I want to kind of get you going on it and, and I'm just doing a lot of improvisation there. Improvisation, yeah, I think that's right. Em embellishments, I don't know. Making stuff up, making stuff up as I go. That's what I'm doing, mostly. And so I want to get you through the chords here and uh, kind of get you started on the song. So I'm going to show you these chords real quick and we'll jump right into this thing. I'm going to move this microphone. Don't think I'm going to need that for the rest of the trip here. So, all right. We got an A chord. It's going to be in the key of A. Okay, you can get that A however you want to. I get it with two fingers. You can get it with one or three or whatever you want to there. And we got a D chord. All right. We've got a D seventh chord. Got an E. I think there's an E seventh I'm playing in the cover. You don't have to do the E seventh. I'm not 100% sure that it's there, but I think there is a little bit of a seventh thing going on there. So I threw it in there. Okay. And then we've got a G chord in there. Okay. A little something different for uh, the key of A, but occasionally you'll see a G in there. And so we've got a G. And again, you can get that G. I'm probably going to get it this way and that way and every which way. So you get it whichever way <laughs> that you want to and, and works for you. Okay. So <clears throat> anyway, I did a little picking in the beginning. show it to you I may break it down I don't know it's uh, I always say I'm not very good at showing licks uh, some people get it from me but I'm not sure I'm the greatest at doing it but anyway so I'm gonna be on the uh, fourth string here okay uh, in that a position so I'm doing a, two licks and doing a, a hammer on on the fourth fret and then grabbing the G string there the third string I'm just gonna call it the strings I'm not gonna call the notes okay so there I'm on the fourth string, grabbing the third string. Now I'm sliding down on the third string from the fourth fret to the fifth fret. And then I'm grabbing it, grabbing it again and coming back. Slow it down here and I'll try to break it down. That's all on the G string or on the third string. I said I wasn't going to say G string. That's all on the G. I did it again. Third string. It's all on the third string. I'm not going to say G ever again. Now the fourth string. Fifth string right there, slide it down from the third to the second. All the third, all the fourth, and the fifth. And on the fifth here, we're kind of walking down on the fifth, fourth, and it's just hammer ons from the second to the on the fourth fret. third string. Alright, so all together now. Alright, now that's a pretty easy part there. Just to kind of walk up to the E there. We're going to do pretty paper here, okay? And just doing a walk up on the, the sixth string. 
second or third fret to the second fret and then open okay all right so that's uh, that's kind of the main lick i want to show you and you can use that actually in the the lead part in the in the break in the middle after the uh, first time we do the chorus okay okay pretty paper it's just down up strokes i think it's just down up all the time maybe it's two ups down 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 up up I I do it, I just ain't sure how to explain it. <laughs> probably somebody out there does. So if you can find a better guitar player, you go ahead. It probably won't be that hard to do, I'll be honest with you. All right, here we go, pretty paper. Pretty paper. And I, this is where I'm kind of changing that E7 here. Pretty paper. It's playing on the jukebox, D7. Got a Where I'm going there, and I got E7. Back to A. Merry Christmas, girl, wherever in the world you are. It goes back to the E there, and then back to A. Okay. okay. And uh, you could do a little. You could do that little walk down that thing I showed you. It's just walking down the fifth. Just hammer on from the second to the fourth, and then you walking down to the, the fourth string and doing a hammer on the fourth fret and ended up on the third string and just you could do that I didn't do that on the, the cover but you could do that to go into the chorus okay and then we're gonna go to the G here coming up okay so it's gonna be a honk it on Christmas today for the silent nights at home Going to the E back to the A there. All right, so we got one more verse, and then you like I said, you could do that little lick. Blue Christmas, okay, and walk right into you know, and just do that same lick if you want to. He does it different because they're you know, they're doing a fiddle and I think steel probably in there, and then the electric guitar, and they're doing a lot of fancy stuff, uh, but uh. You could just run through the chords if you want to. Just run through, you know, A, D, and and, and go up to E, and then back to A. Uh, you know, just kind of keep a little rhythm there going on. Kind of maybe hum it in your in your mind. You know, if you wanted to hum the uh, 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 part of the melody there. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> anyway, something to think about. All right. So so then we go into the second uh, second verse. All right. After coming out of that lead, or you can, if you're not going to do the lead, then you just walk, do that walk up on the sixth string. Third to the second fret. Blue Christmas, turn it up, I wanna hear it. I'm sorry, D7 there, sorry, with the D. So I can unwrap all the memories in my mind. Hey Joe, pour me some Christmas spirit. said on those E7s that I'm doing, you could just stay in E, it would be perfectly fine. And that may be what he's doing anyway. I may be throwing an E7 in there that's not really there. But uh, there's no law against it. So, you know, when I can stretch things out and do what I want to, I do it. So I just want to do it. So again, you know, you do it how you feel. And if you don't want to, if you don't want to mess with that, just, just stay in E the whole time. The D7, I'm pretty sure is there, okay, uh, during the verses, okay. The chorus, it's going to D. Okay, pretty sure, but but the the verses are are the, the D seventh. Okay, and then we go into the chorus. I'm not going to do the chorus again. I'm going to try to keep this as short as possible. We're getting into close to ten minutes here. Uh, we just go ahead and do that chorus again. Same thing, A G D, and uh, and then at the end of it, uh, he does a little uh, the outro or the tag. Uh, uh, goes something like this right here. Yeah, I'll be over you. does that last line of the, the chorus going back to E and then back to the, the A there and I, what I do is I just raise my finger up 
and kind of give you a little ending there. Okay, now if you're playing uh, with three fingers, you could raise your middle finger up. I like to do that anyway, on the highway especially. But anyway, you can do that. Do it, it doesn't really raise it up, making an A7 out of that. And then the end of it. So you can do that, or you can do a little, you want to get a little fancy? whatever you wanted to to end that thing out but have fun with it and have a merry christmas uh, if i don't talk to you before then okay give us a thumbs up on this subscribe to us if you would check out our links down below in the description and check out that link to that cover you can follow along with if you'd like to and uh share us on social media check out other videos out there a lot of alan jackson stuff and george Strait and george jones and you name it and we'll see y'all in the next one thanks